Yo everyone, uh, welcome back on board again, we're back for another session, Maidstone Town, episode number seven, well, we've got a depleted squad, we're scraping the barrel, we have to bring players, because we're playing midweek and Saturdays, and we've got a big massive after this one coming up against Colchester, we've got a big massive FA Cup match, I'm to Peterborough. Uh, third in EFL League one. one, so we need to win if we can to progress. So let's get straight into this one and uh, see how we go and um, see if we, we're still top, we're level on points, we're stock ball at the moment. So let's see how it goes. Let's get into this first match. Okay, okay, then. Right, let's go. First game of four, you know. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson and very excited to be able to... Hello Jada and the old man, welcome. Coming up. Stuart, what are you How's it going? You had a good week? As always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Oh, do you know? My free get your card out, man. So he ain't injured. Yo. Right, so this will be the... Uh, sometimes you get a bit of... Um, Bit of that in there sometimes. Okay, I hope it comes out okay. But sometimes you have it in there, but it doesn't necessarily mean there's always an issue. Um, so I've had some in before, but everything's come up clear. But yeah, you just have to have some checks. Hope, yeah, hopefully it'll be okay, man. Obviously it's worrying, Jaden, yeah man. Oh bloody hell, been off work for Arthur Reed. Yeah, I hope she gets sorted out and find exactly what the issue is, isn't it? And he has options available. Yeah, they are up in second uh third, aren't we? Safe keeper. Elects to go short and quick thinking defensively. Pulls it back. Yeah, I hope Cardiff are coming on okay, you know. So yeah, we're going to do four or five games here. This is be the only stream of the weekend, this one. I 
because I'm back into work tomorrow night, ready for Sunday. It's gone quick, this case, hasn't it? Hopefully, she gets some points on that one. Huh? Danger here as he runs at them. Can he find the net? And still danger here. Yeah, we're in the playoffs. Um, it's good to see where we finish up in the playoffs. Huh? Two games to go. Oh, okay. And he did well to cut it out. Oh, you know, I hope for the playoffs now. Police is still in League Two, that's the main thing, I suppose. Edits. Hello, man. Welcome, Spiky Palmy Army. And hi. <laughs> He's got space. Cutting the ball back. Huge block. They won't complain about having won the corner. Maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. Yeah, Christy, man. They've a short one here. Well, the header was respectable, but the goal didn't work in. Get that thing come up. Yeah. Good play it in. And will it be the level up? I don't know. All square again. What a match this is turning. You got it running now, you got it running now, obviously, because it's yeah, you can be on. Yeah. <laughs> well it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. <laughs> So, a level contest. I nailed darts. That's right. I was just doing like four or five games here and then... It's the only stream I'm going to be able to do this weekend. Yeah. So, come on, mate, stone. Here we go. One all. Oh, deflection out for the corner. Mm. And there's the delivery. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this. If we can win out of this one, be good. Yeah. 
merged edits. Whereabouts are you from, bro? Okay, yeah, yeah. No problem at all. <laughs> yeah, bro. Come on, lads. Let's get into it, huh? McGeehan. Reed. Samson Tavide. Oh, pass. Mm, let me pass. Yes, come on, come on, get in here, bruv. Come on. Now we're kicking butt. Get my butt kicking. That guy's a cool B-Day, you know. <laughs> Both day, B day, you know. D day, you know. Cameron McGeehan. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. It has to be. Oh, lovely deflection. Oh, we took it out. <laughs> and with that, the attack fizzles out. Come on, lads. Ah, oh, no. It's getting our way. Well, he's got the fastest man. Keep saves it, keeps all of it as well. Yeah. Oh. No! Oh, he's put it wide, keep off. <laughs> oh, got away with that one. Jeez. Make a substitution here quickly. It's Levi in the house. Come on, we thought go here, yes, come on. Well, 
have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Edwards. see them getting back into this one well, they've given him too much space but it fizzles out <laughs> piece of defending <laughs> five minutes to go oh that's an interesting pass crossing into the middle <laughs> so it could have been but for the offside flag substitution time it is here right lads here we go <laughs> John McKinney <laughs> McGeehan time situation two minutes the word opportunity oh good sign mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah three one come on Massive cup game now, Peterborough. So I scored out. Kobe Hill, man. Welcome. Welcome on board. Yeah, I'm good, man. You? So I've not been on for a couple of weeks. Been busy here. Yeah? So, uh, yeah. Yeah, Kobe, I'm on tonight, and uh, that'll be it for this weekend because I've got to go football tomorrow, then I get back uh, straight back into work, ready for Sunday morning. So, we're just waiting for your two players in the transfer window a couple of guys to come in from standard liaison 
Oh, you got a 3 3 draw stun at Leon's. Okay. Oh, Liverpool, yeah, they lost uh, Atal Atalanta, wasn't it? Oh, I've got to sort my squad out. <laughs> oh, here we are. Let's have a look. Oh, Bolivar. Oh, no way. 3 1 lead and then they give it away. That's, that's mad, isn't it? It's Bolivar 69. Tough choices there. Uh, probably number three games after this cope. Um, give another three games after this one. So probably like another hour. And a, was it twelve? Yeah, about an hour and a half. Hour. Yeah, then go and do what we have to do, and then I'll catch you later. Um, if not, it'll be next weekend in the next stream because I'm seeing getting back from football tomorrow, I've got to go straight off to work, ready for an early start Sunday morning. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, I'll still be on in 20 minutes, man. <laughs> no worries. Right, let's sort this squad out a bit, Oakley. Midfield. Trouble with all these players. Guys have to stay in our centre mids. <sighs> Levi just disappeared off. I don't know if it's thing. Oh. Oh, was he at work? Oh, he's gone out for food. <laughs> oh. Yeah, so I've got to put a coaster in. Defenders to put in. I've got one. Playing these like Saturday, Tuesday matches and then just trying to build the squad. I know a bit like we do on our one, you, all the players are a bit knackered on energy. 
trying to light. No. Mm. Playing Peter, Peterborough in the FA Cup. League One. <laughs> oh, yeah. See how we go from here. Yeah, I think we're doing it. We'll see how we go. Stuff top it out, eh? Let's go for it, boys. Peter Pro. Uh. We can get by these, be good without a replay. I see a game that made slow to League One side Peterborough FA Cup first round. Well, Derek, players and fans love a cup competition, and although we're a long way away from the final, both teams will be looking to book their place in the next round in the hope of a good run in this tournament. It's a good stop. Nice. A classic example of how to intercept. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, it's a defensive looking lineup, but if the uh, back forward, took it out. Can get close to the front pair and the Lucky geezers. Mm. They should still cause problems today. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, it's a 5-3-2, really, because both wing-backs are more defensive... Oh, he's just took it out as well. <laughs> oh, come on. Yes, come on. 1-0 Maidstone 1, Peterborough 0, come on Important goal Long way to go yet though Colonel's Alcaraz, come on Stones What an emphatic finish that is Untidy in possession. Keep Really good challenge. Espinosa. Okay, now we keep that one, I know. Randall. Pull it off the ball there. Huh? Clark Harris, Hector Kiprianu, and cutting it out. Felix Afena Gian. Oh, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Oh, I just wide. Shit, could have been too near it. Unlucky, just crossed the wrong post. Bill of Cabbage. <laughs> El Peter Bokeva. Putting so much effort into winning back possession. Yeah. Can he play it in? Plays it back. Really sound defending. Denied again. Great defending. Huh? Quick thinking defensively. What a genuine opportunity. <laughs> Tackled men to get out for goal kick. It's 
Seeing your old self, seeing your old self on the lights. Randall Espinosa with it. Ah, oh, no one now. Lucky geezers. <laughs> up effectively Harrison Burrows moving the ball forward with purpose oh, God. it's offside and perhaps yeah, upside, anyway. alert and maybe a little bit more aware in the box is just too static Athena Jan Well, an aimless clearance, and that was down to the pressure. Randall. In with a chance. Tony Hill, come on. Savage. Fina. Guillen. Well, as you can see, he didn't mess about here. He just hits it with such power. That's a wonderful finish. Great finish, Tony Hill. Made stone to Peter Brunel. Wake up first round. So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Cricklow. No space for them here. And he's broken free. Oh. Peter Brain, all sorts of trouble down there. Excellent vision. Course on the tack here. Oh, come on. Oh, uh, yeah, well, yeah, I, I has CV. Yo, man. Yeah. Well, as you can see, yeah, managed to team full stop in you know. well She's got one back now, now. Two one. Give me a tense game this one. Just gonna get one back just before half time. Get yourself a cold, you know. Hi. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, hands TV, yeah, man, I'm um, off to football tomorrow. The time I get back in the evening, um, I've got to get myself ready and straight back into work, keep in the truck for the night, and then early start Sunday, because I'm working Sunday in London, uh, yeah, for the rest of the week. So yeah, tonight's the only stream I'll be doing until next weekend. Yo, Cole Bear, we're back, man. Just about hanging on there with Peter Burr in the FA Cup. Yes, yeah, as TV, yeah, man. Truck driving, yeah. Come on, come on. Yes, come on. 3 1, come on. Get in now. Well, 
here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post country. Cross country. Uh, yeah, all over the UK, you know. Used to do Europe in the past. Uh, not anymore. Go on, the mate's done. Johnson Clark Harris. Three one. Come on, here we go. Get through the first round of the FA Cup. Good use of advantage. Mm, lost it. Bit sloppy there, are they? Shit. Poor clearance. Showing a lot of guile there. Taking it away. Teammates to play it to. Oh, yeah. Come on, Gazers, need to get possession back in. Let's go, come on. Go on up the wing. Shit, lost it again. Successfully cut out. Goddard. Yeah, no worries, has TV, you man, call it. <laughs> Where are you from in the UK, huh? Oh, they've lost it. Twenty minutes remaining. Shit, man, come on. Keep this out. Hey, over the top. How high do you want the goal? <laughs> Not doing too badly, considering like half the players are out of energy. Okay, cool, has TV, man. Made start there. Oh, it's even to get hold of Jenko in a way. Okay, cool. I'm not at Gloucester, I'm not over in Gloucester tomorrow for Maidstone. I'm watching someone else down in New Haven in Sussex. Well, I'm back with, Maid, back with Maidstone um, next Saturday at home to Hampton, Richmond. I'm going to see if I can, uh, because I'm working in West London in the week. Usually get done and stay up there, get done around five o'clock in the evening. I'm going to see if I can get to the Kent Senior Cup final at Bromley. You know? Oh, not sure yet. Might be able to do it on Wednesday. Yeah? Go from West North Acton on the underground to um, Oxford Circus, I think, Oxford Circus, down to the... Um, Bakerloo line to Elephant Castle, then on the train Elephant Castle to Bromley. <laughs> All planned out if it works. I think it's a bit of a ridiculous place to play the game, really. Ten minutes left for play. getting stuck in. Probably both teams be playing second string teams as well, right? Both got important games to finish the season. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Goddard. Shepherd. Trying to get out right now. Here we go. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Here we go. Oh, lucky. 
controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp, the movement's been bright, and they've scored some good goals. They just need to keep their concentration through to the final whistle. Yeah, yeah, has, yeah, man. Troubles, they wouldn't do it at our ground, I suppose, because we're in the final, I guess. Little safety things at Gillingham, will it? Wouldn't play at Gillingham because of safety fears, I reckon. So a personnel change then. And it's gone behind for the corner. Yeah, so Maidstone, a second. Oh, yeah. And that's it, the final whistle, and the hosts will go through. Well, as the scoreline would suggest, it was a comfortable win, but they had to play really well to get their victory. In particular, I thought their midfield really imposed themselves on the game. <laughs> They'll need to continue that going into the next <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Got to do well now, though. Yeah. <laughs> 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 well, he should be pleased with himself today, because he performed really well. Great win for me, it's not a paper. Yeah, nothing special, is it? Obviously, can see in the cup final, but it would have been better if they'd have done it like on a Sunday at the end of the season or something. More people could go. But yeah, that's. But I'll see if I can do that one. If not, definitely at Hampton and Richmond at the Gallagher next Saturday. Huh? I'm just down in New Haven Sorry, watching staying in town time? tomorrow. So when we went there in the FA Cup at staying in, in begin, beginning of well, September, wasn't it, last year? Oh no, yeah. Good one, has TV, man. <laughs> we'll have Gillian and Monier again soon. It won't be on this stream, but it might be next weekend. They've got to play him in a replay now. Yeah, Hampton and Richmond, oh man. It's a team we don't normally beat, are oh, yeah. We struggle against them. Huh? Did we get 5 0 we lost away to them earlier in the season? I went to that one as well, man. <laughs> aye, 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 aye. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Oh, what just now? Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cope. Oh, okay, yeah. done yeah <laughs> yeah cope sorry man yeah i'll catch you next weekend huh? Sixteenth. 
expensive. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just wait a couple of weeks and if we do anything else. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we got yeah, Cobra, have a good good week, man, and we'll catch you next week, huh? Okay. <laughs> no, I got look quite a few in it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Gonna put Randall in there instead of oh no. Skin him out like Randall in. Um cuts. Be a nice cover, can't he? And Gleason. Oh god I'll have to send it back. Take God on our brilliant call. I'll shepherd and go in. Right backs. Is our left back's gone? That was a palace. It's still not good. What's happened here? Got to bring his fitness up. Uh, yeah. So we can play that team now, right? So palace. Gonna have to. Um, Something like Palace will come get him to. Oh well, Palace. Let's get his fitness up. Right, so Maidstone Barrow. Right. Remember playing Barrow in the FA Cup. And we got him in the league. <laughs> Hello and welcome. We have to be honest, it's not a very pleasant night for football. The rain has been coming down heavily in advance of this. For a scump. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. I'm very excited to be in the live action from League Two. Two people in Forest and Gump. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask? What's up, Bruce? It's really old, man. Oh. You've got to think of it from his side of things and try and find something that makes him happy. You know? Oh, is that ways? 
bit grumpy because you went and left him all. Um, go and give him some cuddles and that. <laughs> Goal off the post, son. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Oh, challenge. Look at that. Oakley. That's a good looking ball. Side now. No. Two now. Oh, it was offside, yeah. Goal from Boy Spit given offside. Oh, lucky. Dom Telford. Carter. That looks promising. A glorious chance. And again, that's his Yo, Lewis Fitz. Hello, man. How are you doing? You're up late. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? Two nil. Telford. Might still the win now. Had a good week. Randall. Well, spot on for that challenge. Well, no doubt about it, Stuart. The visitors have been one of the stories of the season. Well, it may have surprised a lot of people, but when you see them play, you understand why they're top of the oh, team. Oh, come wide. They defend well as a team, they win the full back in the <laughs> and they look dangerous. Oh, that's cool, Lewis. Doing my snowy club career. Fourth. That's cool. Campbell. What league are you? What league are you in now? Untidy in possession. Well, they have the ball once oh, more. It's gone lost someone. Oh, League Two, yeah, same as me. I'm in League Two, yeah, no? <laughs> It's Christian. How long you, how long you been doing that, bro? Oh, too high. Yeah, Lewis. So this is the be. I'll be back on next weekend after tonight because I'm. Out of football tomorrow, and then getting back in late tomorrow night, and then got go get ready, go and work for the rest of the week. So I'm working early Sunday morning. Um, so yeah, this will be the only stream this weekend. But I'll be back again next Friday. Giving the ball away. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, giving you some inspiration. <laughs> Oh, what a save. That's cool though, yeah. It's good fun. Get into it. And... Were you on PlayStation? Or Xbox? And... Oh, come on. Oh. Challenge. Oh, he's got... Tackle down. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Can't get past their midfielder, man. 
for the update, Alex. Telford. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and I think it's fair to say they're enjoying this away day. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Oh. Well, they've dominated this first half. Their approach play, their cleverness around the box, and the finishing have been excellent. Oh, so cool. Look at that. Good old tackle. Right side. Oh, it's a corner. It's a corner. Now sending it in. Cleared away comprehensively. Determined defending. Oh, it's out of time. happy doing too badly since we're uh, mixing and matching the team because everyone's like we haven't got enough players for all positions till the transfer window opens so the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway I've got a couple of new players Sorry. Now the situation has oh, changed it? in one of the other games I'm hearing. Let's go to Alex Scott. Oh come on. Oh hang on, Alex, big chance here. Well, oh, okay, yeah, I'll have to listen to that on I'm sorry, you've got to do better. On the way home. Just coming well, waiting for the train at New Haven. Got a score, yes. Come on. Three nil, come on. Well here it is again. And I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper, but you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone and at this level you're always gonna be punished. Yeah, so I'm back with Maidstone um Hampton and Richmond home next Saturday at the Gallagher. Well he looks really pleased, doesn't Good old Mohawk up. And uh, possibly at Bromley, maybe Wednesday night, Kent Senior Cup final. Dangerous looking attack. Could be. Deflection out for Colder. Who's going to get on the end of it? Oh, Owen on the end of that one. Oh, they've well, gone for the cape. Christy uh, had another. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's through here. It's cape, I've got to say. We'll see in the semis. And... That's a brilliant save. Oh, he's in the final, is he? Where's that being played at? Now in a more than decent position. Ooh. Over the top. Yes, come on, 4 0. Kicking their asses. Well, Pee Wee Roller. Ramble. 
moving forward effectively. Just oh, it just wide. Good effort, though. <laughs> Well, Derek, that's a team now, are He on side. No, it's offside. Unlucky. Can a van. Sold my van to Lucas Coverlan. He stopped it. Oh, he saved it on the line. Keeping a clean sheet. Let's hear about it from Alex Scott. It's a goal for Salford City. And now behind by one with 75 minutes play. Thanks as always to Alex. Oh, and lucky. Not even close to hitting the target there. Open up his body, guide it into the corner, but he's got it all wrong. Triple change. Sing your rots out, sing your rots out, sing your rots out, by the way. Straight out the keeper. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Four minutes added time at the end. Can he find the right pass? I could do one more game. Come on, come on. Great win. Keeps us top of the table. 
through to the second round of the FA Cup. Can you chat to us for a second about the match? <laughs> awesome win. Right, doing one more game, folks. be back next weekend as I'm out of football tomorrow. Thanks very much for speaking to us. And then we'll go off to work Saturday night ready for Sunday. My inbox. Balanced. Home to Harrogate Town. Come along, okay. We've got our gate. So the standings. Forty seven level on top of the stop ball. Two of us walking away with the league. Both one fifteen, John two lost three. But we got a better goal difference. Oh yeah, Harrogate 16. Better saw that squad out then.
need that you know, more active let's go for it then arrogate a game that speaks for itself in so many ways and a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football I'm delighted yeah. to be able to report I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live action from League Two. Yeah, Come yeah. On. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Not smooth in possession. Yeah, you've got the energy there, haven't you? And the lineup for the home side well they're going to play with a front two which means they have to link up with each other as much as possible if they do that well they'll mm -hmm. certainly pose a threat it looks like a 5-3-2 really yeah we do have five at the back it's a good wing backs you can see when it comes to the hosts they certainly know a thing or two about scoring goals in fact Stuart they have the most potent attack in the league well their forward should be full of confidence they've been in fantastic form of late and it bodes well for the neutrals today hopefully we're in for an entertaining match might be a chance here oh keep a side Really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Oh, man. Spiky bomb helmet. And beyond the byline, goal kick then. Stones ain't going up. <laughs> what about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? Be too much to go up, isn't it? Alcaraz. A timely intervention. Yeah, it's too soon to go up this season, isn't it? Third, huh? Will lie. No, I won. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This is a decent looking attack. Here. Yeah. Options in the centre. A good defending. Flattered out of there. Okay, no, it's the top one goes up and then one from the next six goes up. So there's only two go up out of the division. One as champions and one from playoffs. So. Yeah, got a chance, Joey, but, um, but 
after last season, I mean, it's, bit, it's too early. We need to have another year in this league. You know? you, you're black and white now. I guess that's dark, is it? Yeah, we're the champions, Yeovil, yeah, man. Are you Dartford? Dartford supporter? Oh, yeah, cool. I was hoping you wouldn't go down. I'm hoping you're not going to go down myself. Hoping, hoping you'll stay up, you know. Shit, the ski's on the break, you know. All hands on deck. Well, unfortunately, it fizzled out in the end. You'd rather see Eastbourne go down rather than yourselves because it's always a good derby day when we play each other, isn't it? Whatever the result is, you know, it's, it's always a feisty home and away game, isn't it? <laughs> Got you over tomorrow. Sure, no Roma. So you over might play a more relaxed game, really. They're already champions, man. Oh, it was close. We've done the scoring there, man. Can actually finish. We can actually finish above Chelmsford. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, might put. Yeah, fingers crossed you stay up, I know. I think Truro are messy. We've got Truro tomorrow, so we could do you a favour, I know. We beat Truro tomorrow at Gloucester. Um, we could help you out a bit there, I know. <laughs> no, it's crazy, isn't it? Have you sacked your manager? It's obviously the players are not playing for him, are they? No? Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments are Oh, what one? <laughs> the one you've got at the moment, or the one before you lost. Yeah, something needs to be sorted out, man. No? Need a goal here. Ah, oh, not like that, we're not. Again, oh. it's going to be a nil nil. I'm not careful. Attacking with vigor and a chance to get in here. No, we oh, you want the ball. That's a wasted opportunity to get their noses in front here. Okay, now that's good. No? 
That's a good stop. No. Oh, keeper. No. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. And the ball moving again. Sort of oh, hell. It's good, it's good stuff, though. Come on now, boys, come on. Oh. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Playing with plenty of zest and energy on the front foot once more. And this to level it. And a decent save. Keep us saving the ball. Something has happened in one of the other venues. A goal there. Alex Scott with the news. It's a goal for Salford City. They now lead 3-2 with 76 minutes on the clock. Alex with the info as ever. Huh. After that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Oh, I love it. So a personnel change then. Yeah, it's a... I don't know how tough the Ismian Premier is, isn't it? It's got some good teams in there. Well, didn't really make the keeper think too much but yeah, I should imagine you should walk that one. That is such a good chance as well. They're using the space really well, you've got to say. Oh, hey. That's a great effort, was it? Come on, lads. We've got to try and get this goal back and get a draw out of here at least. Stop ball could go top it. Who's this to game? Can he finish them all? Can they stop it going in? Very well to win it back. What can they do from here? Real chance. Ah, oh, Tony, we've lost this one. It's a bad scoring point. Yes, that's a trouble, Joey, isn't it? When, um, You lose players if you don't if you get relegated or if you don't go up to the next league you lose players i think we're going to lose some players as well if we don't go up especially the goalkeeper now. then you have, then you have to restart all over again then you are not build again Lost this one. We are going to have two additional minutes. Sam Cornstein, yeah, he's already done a new contract. Huh?
Oh, it's got one back. It's too late now. It's over pretty much, you know. We ain't got enough time to get one back. You know? We're nearly time at the end. You know? Yeah, look. <laughs> Two one loss. Chance for Harrogate, a stop port. Chance for stop port to go top. Some questions regarding the match. Do you know what? I'm going to do one more game. Yeah, one more. I'll be all, thank you. It's for those are. Grims be down. Yeah, that's going to be the last one. Isn't it? Why a Brian? What's this one? Is it a fake up? Julian and my home. 6th of January, New Year. Made stone with Julian and Brian. Brian we made stone. Must be a wake up third round then. 7th of January. Let's have a look at the uh, calendar. So the final one we got here is Grimsby. Three league games and then we're going to New Year. That's the BSM trophy, not scouting. Way in the cup, yeah look. Emirates if they come third round like way of Brian. So that's got out again. What do you say we got? Our Grimsby. Stop at the top. Rave. So the team here. Who 
Who we playing next? Why in real? Is that real life? Um, or why at, why at Truro tomorrow, Jerry? They're playing. Oh, they're playing at Gloucester City's ground. So Maidstone away at um, Truro City. So I mean, we could do you a favour there if we beat them. Um, and hopefully he's will lose. And you grab some points or something. Right, what we got here? Yeah, beat him, yeah, man, it'd be good. <laughs> yeah, true, we're applying like Saturday, Wednesday. Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday or something. They're playing like ridiculous games every week to catch up all the games in hand they have. Three games a week, I think. Certainly Tuesday, Thursday or something. Good enough. Let's go for it. Right, folks, last one. It's be the last one until next weekend. It's a working Sunday. It'll be too late time I get back with football tomorrow. And all week long, the football chat has seen. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all. On I'm the sign that blue and white. Get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, ready here in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham, and Coventry midfielder Stuart Robson. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live action from Leeds. Oh, City yeah, coming up. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff earn the right to play if you can win your individual battles outrun your opponent eventually you'll get the space to show your ability i'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today harry clifton it might be not an effort for mm -hmm. a personal scrapbook over the top The visitors will be thinking about claiming all three points here, Stuart. They do know that if results go their way, they could end the day at the summit. Well, at this stage of the season, Derek. Oh, it's developing nicely for them here. In it goes, and are they going? No wonder they're celebrating. One nil. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Couldn't hang on to it. Now can they make something happen? Oh, could be an opportunity here. It's close. And 
Andrews. <laughs> well, they know they need to stop it. Can he convert? Oh, good save. <laughs> given us away nice tackle lads now options are plenty this looks promising and it's played into the center was it a That's great up. clearance about the delivery and crossed in the direction of the back post <laughs> defending to stop a decent looking attack blocking the emergency exit please return to your vehicle immediately thank you our position then eh? Come on, 2 0. Yeah, just what the doctor ordered. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Harry Clifton. And now their turn to have the ball. Goddard. Really well played pass. Carlos Alcaraz. And he takes on the shot. Well, oh. he's a but not quite nice. on the target. And they're making a change. Yo, Kyle, how you doing, brother? Uh, no, not going today on Maidstone, um, out Hampton and Richmond. Huh? Might go Wednesday. Cup by no one. A different game tomorrow. Oh. A chance then for the respective managers to address the chance. Yeah. Half time then. Well, 
as they get the ball rolling again. Interesting to see how the second half pans out. Well, it's a good looking position. Is there a goal in the future? Oh, where's that going? That's wrong. Over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Well, the referee has decided to book him. Well, it's not a good challenge, and quite rightly, he gets a yellow card for that. Danny Amos. Danny Rose. Well, a very effective play in possession. Chance to reduce the arena. Oh, my goal. 2 1. Back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2 1. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Possession lost. And we want it back. Cool. Oh, that's a good fucking injury now. Geezer now. And across the touch line, so a throw in here. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. He's moving quite gingerly because his foot is sore because he got trodden on in that last challenge. Cheers, Jeff. in the air but he did enough to stop him scoring well, they're trying to get right into his face difficult to stop him well he didn't really trouble the keeper to be fair the mm -hmm. angle was tight well i'm not sure that was the right option it was always going to be difficult to score from there an alert intervention well, the hosts have completely bossed the game in the last 15 minutes and have created one or two good chances. Sure. If they can continue to play with this domination, it's only a matter of time before they draw level. A rotting <sighs> under the pressure, and now they try to go forward. Counter attacking chance. And fed forwards. Oh, what a goal. Come on, 3-1. So wanted. Gets in now. Secure the win. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Harry Clifton. Unlucky Harry. Time just challenged magnificently. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, I gave him the big build up, but the keeper has it comfortably. Harry Clifton. <laughs> Well, they're 
on the scent of something positive. But quick thinking defensively. It's still alive. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. They've lost it. He's a goal now, thank okay. God. Can't really get at the opposition here. And still pressing. Oh, what a cross. What a header. It's a full line. Sealed a victory. Well, here's the replay, and what a well delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And so into the final five minutes. A very good tackle. <laughs> and teammates around him. And a bit physical now, huh? And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Cross fired over. The chance is on. But quite simply not precise enough from that position. Espinosa. Come on, very big trade to finish. Four one. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their Come on. Play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated. Come on. All right, just a couple of questions for you. Just interview. Interview time. Yeah, man. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Mm -hmm. folks we're done so thanks for watching spiky balmy army just behind stockport one point and um, top three go up anyway look at that stockport mate stone jelly you could probably go up automatically yeah. So, 22 games in just, just under halfway through the season. Next stream will be next weekend. I will be back Friday next week. Because I'm out of football tomorrow. The time I get back, I've got to work Sunday. And then I'm not going to have the time to stream tomorrow. So, yeah, we'll be back next Friday. 
So in the meantime, I take care of everyone. Thanks for tuning in and watching Spiky Barmy Army. Thanks for supporting. We're on the road to 1K subscribers and we'll um, catch you next week. Thanks for following and supporting. Take care. Peace. Have a great week. Bye for now. Peace.